Hi, I'm Mateo, and today we got the part two for the standing in line update in PetSim 99. And with this update came a lot of very interesting stuff, such as a free to play Titanic and a bunch of other free to play huges. Now I've done the research and found all of the odds and everything that you need to know about this update today. So in today's video, we're going to talk about how you can get the best possible odds at this free to play Titanic, how you can make some diamonds in this update, as well as some other very juicy things. So stay tuned for that. Now, if you enjoy this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing for more as it helps me out so much. Now, without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. All right, you guys. So here we are in the part two of the stand in line for a huge event, except for this week, it is stand in a line for a Titanic. So yes, we got another free to play Titanic. It seems like this is going to be big games, new theory when they don't have a lot of content, they're just going to give players a chance at a free to play titanic to hopefully make up for the fact that there's nothing really included in these updates now the other thing that we could see that big games is doing with these updates is that they come up with some grand idea and they kind of stretch it out for a few weeks just so they don't really have to think about anything else like with the halloween event world for example they made that world and then for the next week they just added a little bit to it just to make it a tad bit more interesting but honestly for this week's update they didn't really do that we essentially have the exact same framework as last week just put into this week except for the free to play titanic at the end and even in the update logs you guys can see for yourself it says line for huge was seven days ago and this week it's line for titanic and then if we go ahead and click inside here you could see there really isn't much content at all it's kind of embarrassing how small these updates have gotten for pet sim and i'm pretty sure everything right here was in last week's update the only new line is this part where it says limited titanic pet and then inside the event room itself the only real thing they added is the ability to trip players now as well as this locker room which i'll show you how to get into shortly we also got a school gift which is different from last week's gift bag so that is new but basically besides that that is it we also got a brand new exclusive egg the chad exclusive egg as you can see over here here is the exclusive titanic chad monkey which is honestly pretty funny i think this is a decent egg if anything compared to like the last few that we've had it's definitely a different looking one we definitely have not seen something like this before they're all kind of like lifting weights and working out and stuff like that now because we are partner we do have a bunch of these eggs so we'll probably open that for a video that i'll have later out tonight well that is actually very very shocking to see what is this skin this guy has I, I don't know what that was but I I hate that okay now that is pretty much everything in the update but we can show you all of the new things that we got and how this update works so if we hop into this stand in line event world obviously once we load in we are going to be put at the end of the line and it's going to be the exact same thing as last week so here we are in the classroom now there is a lot more people in line just because this is update day but in like the next next day or two there the line will probably go only to like max right there but essentially how this event world works is that the further you get in line the more chance you have at opening one of these huges now while you're sitting in line you are going to be opening pets one at a time so you're not going to be opening 99 like you usually would in a regular world but instead you're going to be opening one at a time and every time that you open you're going to get these coins which then you can go ahead and use to cut in line in front of the person person in front of you so you're going to want to make sure you have auto cut on just so you can move further and further because as you go obviously you're going to have a higher chance at getting one of these huges and i'll have the odds on the screen here from copycat on twitter where he tells you what the exact odds are for each of the eggs in this line so obviously this is line egg one line egg two line egg three and then line egg four so according to this screenshot from copycat line egg four has a one in a million chance at getting the huge which is pretty pretty insane because you are only opening one pet at a time so one in a million is quite a lot if for example we were opening 99 eggs at once then that would be basically
basically a one in a hundred million chance at getting the huge so it's definitely not easy but those are the odds of getting that now another major aspect about this update is the upgrade section where you can go ahead and upgrade how much coins you get how much it costs for people to cut you a bunch of very important stuff honestly but in this week's update we did get a bunch of new upgrades that involve tripping and then there are a couple very important ones like increasing your chances of getting the adoption gifts now these are probably the best upgrades that you can get in this new update i would definitely suggest picking these up if you can as well as this one below it that increases your chance at getting a school gift timer now i'm pretty sure the way the school gift timer works is it's just like random spots in this line get selected as somebody that's going to get the gift and then once the timer's up for that spot if you are standing in that spot you are going to get the gift like for example you can see over here in spot 10 there is a timer going off so in basically 45 seconds if you are standing in spot 10 you are going to get that school gift now inside that gift is actually one of the new huges that we have to talk about so if i pull up the school gift here you can see i actually went ahead and bought some just from the training plaza while i was going around inside the school gift you can get the new huge uh what's it called the librarian beaver and i'll have this screenshot from copy cat on the screen here as well he says the odds to get one of these huge librarian beavers is going to be a one in 2208 chance so essentially at a current rep value of one million diamonds you're going to have to spend like 2.2 billion just to get this huge librarian beaver so i'm not sure if that's too worth it i'm not sure what the rep is for that huge quite yet but i definitely wouldn't go ahead and start buying up these gifts trying to get that huge now i'm not sure why the gifts are still a million even though it's like hours and hours after the update has come out i guess it's just because only one person in line is going to be getting those gifts so it's just not that common of a gift that you're going to be getting constantly while playing now besides the huge librarian beaver there is one more thing that is super important in these school gifts and it's not going to be that booth or the hoverboard that you can see there below the huge it's actually going to be the locker key so there is in the loot pool i had to wait a little bit Bit, you could see it's a 0.225 percent chance to get the locker key from these gifts now that locker key is very important because that actually gets you into a room that gives you three times a better odds at getting the new free to play titanic now hopefully we can actually open some of these school gifts and get one of those keys i'm not sure how rare they are really i know i said 0.225 percent but I, i'm not even sure what that means inside of a gift bag so let's just open eight of these Hopefully we can get one so that we can get into that locker at the end. All right, so we didn't get anything from those four gifts. Let's open the last four that we got. See what we can get. Hopefully it's not too, too rare to get one of these keys. And yeah, guess not. So unfortunately, we weren't able to get one of the keys for the locker room. But if we go into free cam and come into the final egg room, I've been sitting in this line and I absolutely have not moved. If we check, look, I'm still in this red circle or not red circle, but I'm still like at the fourth egg. So I have not moved and it's been like 20 minutes or something. So I just wanted to show you guys what the final egg room actually looks like. Now in here is where you do have a chance at getting the Titanic. So I'll have the odds on the screen here, but from this final egg, you have a one in 114,000 chance to get the huge teacher cat, but you also have a one in 4 million chance at getting the titanic teacher cat so as you guys probably know that is a very rare chance there also isn't like a limited like sign here usually when we have a free to play titanic it's like it says there's like a limit of 500 but this time around there is no sign like that so i guess theoretically you could just open as many as you get lucky enough to get now there is one more free to play huge that we got in this update and that's actually going to be the huge principal ant eater now this huge principal principal anteater is actually going to be in this secret locker room so if we go through we can actually just cheese it and look inside now inside this room you also have a three times chance at getting your titanic so if you do want the best possible odds at opening the titanic teacher cat it's going to be in this room because in this room you have a one in 1.34 million chance at getting the titanic teacher cat which is three times easier than the egg out here in the regular final egg room but besides the titanic teacher cat you can also get the huge principal ant eater from this egg 
but the chances to get it are a whopping 1.14 million chance which means the odds to get this huge principal anteater are just absolutely insane because as you know when you get to this front room you're only gonna have like five minutes or something to actually open the egg so if you go ahead and actually open the locker room on the right with the locker key from the school gift that means you can only open that titanic at 3x chances for like five six minutes and you only have a one in a million chance to get either the principal anteater or the titanic teacher cat so essentially this is just going to be another afk update there really isn't any content in this update all you do is wait in this line and then you can turn your auto cut on and while you're afk and you're gonna go to the front and have a chance at getting this titanic and then once your timer's up you're gonna be sent to the back of the line to just rinse and repeat while you're completely afk and if you do have one of those locker keys you might as well use it to try to open for like five or six minutes over here in the locker room but even a 3x chance at getting this titanic isn't that big of a deal especially because it's gonna take you so long of opening this egg to even have a chance at getting it so honestly it all just seems pretty useless but yeah that's pretty much it so let's just head back to the regular world because there's nothing really for us to do in there besides that of course we did get a new forever pack that's something they don't forget to put in every single week we got another forever pack with a brand new huge as well so this huge coach tiger is the one that you can get if you want to waste your robux and then of course we did get the chad egg that i talked about earlier and of course you can get these locker keys from the forever pack as well so that is going to give you a three times chance at getting that free to play titanic so basically the people that spend all of their robux are going to have those keys for the most part because it is so rare to get one of the gift bags and the chance to get the key out of the gift bag is even more rare so of course they throw it in the forever pack so that more people are encouraged to buy it and hopefully have a better chance at that titanic but besides that i think we pretty much covered everything in this update you guys let me know what you guys think honestly i think this was a pretty weak update not very surprising from big games this is a lot like the past updates they've had recently i definitely don't think they should have extended this update another week because this was just a flop of an idea in general and i don't think there was that many people in the community who really enjoyed it it basically just turned the game into a afk simulator even more than it was before but hey let me know in the comment section what you guys think thank you guys so much for watching hope to catch you in the next one and peace out